Hey, welcome back to my channel. Um, I know I've been gone for like two months not filming anything, and that is because I was just dealing with a lot of personal stuff. I was in a dark place and I just needed to take some time for myself but I am back and I am back starting the new year with the very first BoxyCharm of the year and I'm excited about it. I wasn't excited about November or December's. Uh, I, I just I didn't like them. Um, there's nothing really else I can say about those two particular boxes other than I just didn't like them. I didn't like none of the products that came in them. But this one, I'm super excited about and very pleased with. I've already opened it. I've already looked at it. I posted a picture of it on my Instagram. So if you follow me on there, you've probably already seen it. But um, let's just jump right into the box. Um, of course, right on top, we always have the lovely card that they send you with all your information of each product on the back. And I am going to read off like everything for the products as we go through them. So I'm going to start at the very top of the list, which is the Barigio, which I think I'm saying that right. If I'm not, I'm sorry. Uh, the Barigio um, Roscaro Milk Reparative Leave-In Conditioner. And I got one of these in the first boxy charm that I ever got. And I love this stuff. It definitely works good for my hair. I have very dry, rough split ends, and this helps. It also helps as like a detangler for if your hair gets very matted the way mine does. But this retails for $12. And sorry, it's, it's cold, and I don't want to run the heater because it's just super loud. So, But anyway, on to the details of this product is effectively restore your hair's softness manageability, moisture, and shine with Regio's Rascaro Milk Spray. Infused with the signature blend of ultra-nourishing rose hip, argan, and coconut oils, this spray works to de detangle wet hair and protects against heat while locking in moisture, restoring luster, and diminishing frizz, which I have all of those problems with my hair. So, Love that I got another bottle of this. The next thing that is on the list is the Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick. And let me flip that right side up. This matte liquid lipstick delivers long lasting color that perfectly outlines and fills in lips. The stunning pigments stay put all day with minimal transfer. While maintaining a comfortable wear, infused with vitamin A and antioxidants, your lips will look and feel healthy all day. And this retails for $20. And the color, I'm not sure if it fits for me. It's, it's not my kind of color. But we will check it out anyway. I'm just going to swatch it on my hand. Just do a little swatch right there. And... There's the swatch, and it kind of has like a plummy look to it whenever I swatch it, so I'm just curious if it's going to dry like that, because in the tube it looks very like, kind of like a rusty kind of brown shade. I hope that's picking up on camera, um, but yeah, there's what it looks like in the bottle, and there's what it looks like on my hand. So we're, we're just going to let that dry. We're going to come back to it. Um, um, I guess I could... Let's, let's see how it looks on the lips. Alright, so I am back with the uh, Ofra Liquid Lipstick um, on my lips. And this is the shade Havana Nights. Um, like I said, I don't know if it's really a color for me. Wait, I don't know. I'm not feeling it. But I can say that it does feel good on my lips. So, the next thing that we are going to move on to, and I'm going to save the palette for last, just in case you're wondering, um, is the Fetcha Luminous Dewy Skin Face Mask. You get two of these in this box. Um, well, oh, sorry, I'm holding that upside down. <laughs> um, I obviously am not going to be reviewing this right now, but I will do a video where I review this. Um, we can just play with the mask, see how it feels. Maybe have a little chit-chat. 
but for this it says nourish skin from within using this lightweight uh, excuse me this lightweight blend of rice germ oils vitamin E essential fatty acids and highly concentrated botanical oils and, and extracts each mask is designed for maximum absorption delivering a 20 milliliters of skin quenching serum and in, uh, importing an instant dewy luminous glow. A scientifically perfected trio of fermented Japanese anti-aging superfoods like green tea, rice, and algae instantly restores skin's health and radiance. And these retail for $24. So, very nice. Um, love anything that makes me appear younger. The next thing, this, which is something that I'm not going to use, um, I don't use brow pencils, I don't use, you know, brow, pen, brow anything to do with the brows. I, I groom my brows and that's it. <laughs> um, but anyway, it's the Billy, Billion Dollar Brows Universal Brow Pencil, and uh, it comes with the spoil at the end, and obviously the pencil part is over here. Specially and carefully formulated to work perfectly with most skin tones and brow colors. This self-sharpening pencil glides into your brows without tugging or pulling your skin. This spool, the, excuse me, the spoolie at the end makes for easy blending and the smooth and creamy formula makes for easy application. And this retails for $18. And I will show you, that's the pencil part. And it's just a light brown shade. It's not nothing super extreme. And there is the spoil at the end. But like I said, this is something that I probably would never use. Now, on to the grand finale, the thing that I was most excited about. And I, I did take sneak peeks to see what was coming in the boxes. Um, so I'm super happy that I got this. And it is the... Rainforest of the Sea Volume 3 Tarte Eyeshadow Palette. And this is what the box looks like. But what I'm really in love with is the palette itself. That, to me, is just super cute and gorgeous. <laughs> I love it. I love that it fits perfectly in the palm of my hand. Um, I, I am wearing some of the shades right now. So it may look a little dirty because I am wearing them. But there is the palette itself, and let's just get rid of that little screen protector. There we go. And I am going to swatch these for you. But first, let me read what it says about this palette. Tarte Limited Edition Rainforest of the Sea Highlighting Eyeshadow Pal Palette Volume 3. Dive into this vegan, crease-free eyeshadow palette that features seven highly reflective plush micro shimmers and one matte nude that serves as the perfect transition shade. This blendable and long wear formula is enriched with vitamin E and antioxidants helping to hydrate and protect the lids. And it retails for $36. Okay, so let's go ahead and swatch this Tarte palette. Um, I'm actually wearing some of the shades right now. Um, I used uh, Tiki, which is the matte color for my base. And I went in with Escape and Jewel for my lids. And hopefully you can see that. But uh, we're just going to swatch from the top. And I'm just going to go in right next to where we did the swatch of the lippy. Um, the first one we're going to go with is right up here on the top. And that is Escape. And then I'm going to go in to Treasure right here next to Escape. Pop that right beside it. And then we're going to go in with Jewel right underneath Treasure. And then we're going to do Compass right underneath Jewel. And use my thumb to go in with here onto raise and just pop that right next on the other side of the lip and switch hands because I just ran out of fingers 
and go into this really dark color, which is Malibu. Put that right across the top of my hand. Um, then we're going to go into Heat Wave. And once I'm done, I'll show you all the swatches and give you my opinion on each one. Now we're going to go into the matte one, which is called Tiki. And I'll just rub that across the top right there. Okay, so my first impression of each one, well not my first impression because I've already used it on my lids, but um, some of the shades, in my opinion, do kind of look the same. I really, really hope that y'all can see this and it's not showing up as like a blaring white light, but in my opinion, I don't know, Treasure and Compass kind of look the same. This is Treasure right here, and this is Compass right here at the bottom. And to me, those kind of look the same. Um, now, Jewel is very, very pretty. This is Jewel right here. Well, and then, on the other hand, this shade right here is called Malibu and I really like that one and then right under that is Heat Wave and Tiki you really cannot see it I think it's because it's just meant to be a base coat um, hopefully these are showing up very well on camera much better than I thought they were because I don't know for some reason I feel like that light just hits my hand and it just blinding and mutes everything out but no I mean as far as the shades go they're all very beautiful. The only nitpicky thing I have to say about it is I feel like uh, Escape and Compass look the same. So like I said, this is Escape here and this is Compass down here at the bottom. And I feel like they're just very similar. And I don't know. Um, you can see a slight difference but not a huge difference I guess is what I'm saying. But overall, I am, I'm happy with this boxy charm box that I got. I'm glad that the first one of the year uh, started off to be, you know, something that I was happy with. Maybe the reason I didn't like the last two is because I was in such a depressed place that nothing was making me happy. Um, so I just had to take time to get myself right to be able to come back and actually do good videos. So thank you for all of my subscribers who have bared with me through my bouts of just not uploading consistently and, you know, saying that I'm going to do it and then not doing it. Um, you know, we all have issues. We all have things that we have to get through. And just thank you for watching my channel. Thank you for being a subscriber. And as always, please like my videos. Please comment your thoughts. Um, you know, just show me your support. Uh, it would be a dream for me to see my channel grow and, you know, every time I get a new subscriber, it's like a little blessing to me. So, thank you for that and thank you to all my longtime subscribers and viewers. Y'all are always awesome. Um, but yeah, BoxyCharm, first one of the year. Thank you for actually doing it right this time and giving me a box that I'm super happy about. Um, I'll see y'all next time. Um, hopefully the next video that we do is going to be playing with these little masks right here and, I don't know, maybe just talking about some stuff. Alright, I will see you all later and have a wonderful day. Bye.